Alright, yo, what's up? It's Patrick here. Today, um, I don't care if this is a video, but today I'm going to be showing you how you can download, like, custom texture packs, uh, on iPad. So, and just iOS in general. So, I mean, yeah, let's just get into it. So, um, the requirements you're going to need for this is you're going to need to own Minecraft, legitly. Um, you're going to need the Safari app, and then you're going to need the Files app. So, um, that's all you're going to need to do this. Let's, let's get into it. First thing you want to do is you want to open Safari, um, and then you want to go to the top search bar, and you want to type in MCPEDL, just like that. Hit enter, and it's going to take you to a website that looks like this. Um, now you just want to press up here, and then you can search for a resolution of texture pack you want, or you can just type a texture pack into here for like PVP texture pack, just for example. So, um, just once you've searched for it, or once you're searching for a resolution, just scroll through, and, um, just look for a pack you like. Alright, so once you find the texture pack you're gonna use, I'm gonna be using Imaginary 16X. Go ahead and, like, click on the little image, or just click where it says, like, the pack name, and it'll take you to a, like, a page like this. And it's gonna have, like, the description, and it'll have, like, pictures and videos of the texture pack. So just scroll down. The site takes a while to load sometimes. Just scroll down until you find the downloads tab right here. And then uh, just click on the download. It's the creator like decides what the download thing says. So like it can say something like this where it's download day, download night. It could say like download MC pack, download for bedrock. Just find the just find the one that's for bedrock or whichever version you want. And then press on the on any of the download links. If it if it gives you the choice between Java and Bedrock. Make sure you pick the one for Bedrock. And also make sure it's a .mc pack. Now, it'll either, there's like four different pages it can take you to once you click the download link. I'm going to try my best to show you all of them, but I don't know if I'll be able to. Uh, the first one is this one where it wants to take you to Link for Ties. So just press click here to continue. And it'll uh, take you to like something like this. Just press this top URL right here. And then press on it again. And then press copy. Now you want to go back and you want to search linkbypasser.net, just like that. Now uh, it'll take you to a page like this. So you just press where it says paste your link here. And if it takes you to something like this, just close out of it because we don't need that. So And then press it again and then paste it and then press bypass. Now it'll shoot out a media fire link like this. Go ahead and press on the media fire link and it'll take you straight to the download page. And that way you don't have to download anything or anything like that from Link for Ties. Now all you want to do is press download and then it'll pop up something like this, press download. And then right here where this little like arrow is, you can press that to check uh, the status, like um, how, how fast it's downloading. And then once it's done, you can just go ahead and close out of Safari because we don't need it anymore. Now open up the files app press on downloads and then if you if you just have if this is your first time doing it which I'm assuming it is if you're watching this video it'll just be the one texture pack but I've done it a few times so um, just scroll through and then find your texture pack and then press on it and hold it as you can see this is imaginary 16 x just press to hold it and it'll pull this up press move and then press on my iPad or on my iPhone depending on what device you're using and then press minecraft and then press games and then press com.mojang and then scroll down until you see resource underscore packs. Press it and then press copy. Uh, and now we're done. Now you can go ahead and you want to restart your Minecraft. And then you can go ahead and open up your Minecraft. And it, you should be able to just use your texture pack. So once you're in Minecraft, just go ahead and go in settings. And then scroll down to global resources. And then press my packs. Uh, and as you can see... Just go ahead and press on that and activate, and your pack should be there. Um, and just, it'll load, and boom, that's how you, that's the first way, or that's the first method on how to get them. Alright, so the second page that it can take you to when you press the download link is going to be something like this. Just press I'm not a robot, and then you'll have to wait through like the 30 seconds or whatever, and uh, it, it shouldn't take too long. Alright, now once it's done, 
just go ahead and press get downloads and it'll say files ready just press on uh the texture pack M once again make sure it's got mc pack i'll take this page press download and then it's going to be the exact same ones uh, the rest of it is just going to be the exact same as you did before you'll see your status up here it'll download you can just go uh you know to files move it it's going to be the exact same as you did the other method all right now the third and i believe the final page that it will take you to is going to be one where it just it's going to be it's going to look like the one that took you to link for ties but it's just going to take you straight to the media fire so first click here to continue and it's just going to take you straight to the media fire and once again you're just going to download this exactly like you did the first way all right it's going to be it today um like it I don't know if I mentioned this, but if you if you want one that's a tutorial that's similar to this, but for like skins and stuff, uh, make sure you drop a like. Let me know. Uh, like if you enjoyed this, still uh, like. And like I said, we're so close to 1,000 subscribers. Let's get there. And uh, yeah, that's it for me. Peace out and roll the sick outro.